An 81-year-old female presents to the emergency room after suffering a fall and being unable to walk. Hip x-ray shows an acute left-sided femoral neck fracture. And incidentally, you detect hundreds of these small tissue calcifications. Head imaging shows multiple cysts in different stages in the brain. And further evaluation even shows cysts that have disseminated into nearly all of her muscle. A stool sample from the patient confirms tinea solium tapeworm infection, suggesting all of this began from the ingestion of infected pork meat that was undercooked, as well as the incidental ingestion of tapeworm eggs. These worms have a scolex that attaches to our intestines and they survive and feed off of our diet, growing up to 20 to 40 feet long. And then they can break off and disseminate through the blood into the striated muscle, liver, and other tissues. Each of these worms can produce up to 50,000 eggs. When this parasite crosses the blood-brain barrier, it causes something called neurosister sarcosis. In this patient, this led to a seizure and the subsequent fall that led to the fracture.